Hey there, Anastasia and Valerie, it's Chuck again. So we're gonna go take a look around the outside of the house and show you a little bit of the neighborhood. So I'm standing in the breezeway in between the house and the detached garage. So we're just gonna go out through this nice little iron gate and step out to the front. All right, I'll let you kind of take a look around this side of the neighborhood. You're, you're on a corner lot here. It's a really big lot. I'll show you a better view of it in a second. This is out in front of your garage. As I mentioned earlier, it's a two-car garage. There is a lot of parking here. You could very easy and comfortably fit three across and at least two down. So you could put, realistically, six cars could fit here if you're having a big party. And then another small one could even fit up here if you had to. This is the alleyway that I mentioned. And like I said, you could put a gate in this back fence if you wanted to put in a, something so you could have access for vehicles or RVs, something like that. So we're panning across your two-car garage. And we'll just kind of walk around. This is you know, very typical Florida neighborhood here. Most of the houses were built in the early 50s. Your house was built in 1947 originally. Of course, it's been completely renovated. So we're walking across. Hey, I don't know if these grow over near you, but these are plentiful here, these hibiscus. Got a lot of tropical vegetation around the area. These things are just beautiful. And you've got two nice big hibiscus bushes. So I'll get back out here to the street. There's your garage, the breezeway, the side of your house. I'll just kind of give you a quick look at the neighborhood. Right. This neighborhood has sidewalks, which are great for walking. And uh, this neighborhood still has the old octagonal blocks. Those are kind of a hallmark of St. Petersburg. They're, uh, they're kind of going away slowly but surely because as they deteriorate, they just put in standard concrete ones that don't have any trip hazards. But I kind of like them. They're, they kind of have a kind of a vintage feel to them. Is front of your house. And over here, that's where that pedestrian gate is. It goes to the backyard, where I mentioned that you could make a wide gate if you wanted to have some uh, RVs or something. And you'd have to just put down some gravel or pavers or something. And and then have to deal with this curb here a little bit. But everything is doable. I'll give you kind of a look around the neighborhood over this way. Like I said, it's just, you know, standard Florida neighborhood, just like you'd see in most of St. Petersburg, really. And coming back around here to the front of your house. So I hope this showed you everything that you wanted to see. And uh, of course, if you need to see anything else, or if you want to do a FaceTime, I'll come out here and do it for you. It's a beautiful house. And I appreciate you watching. Bye-bye.